Hello, my name is Xavier Johnson. I'm the current student government president. So when I say UT, I need all of you to say SA. Y'all ready? I said, are y'all ready? Alright. UT! 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 The reason that I wanted to be part of SGA is because I had a lot of vision for where I wanted to see the university go and I think the students also kind of shared that vision and so SGA gave me a sort of like a an organizing body that allowed me to exercise those views and help represent the student body. <clears throat> My major is sociology and probably originally I never would have seen how it relates to student government in any way shape or form but kind of looking at it like really the campus is one giant demographic group with people different like sociology is a study of people so it's really they kind of relate a lot. The biggest and most important responsibility of the president is to represent the students. At the end of the day, that's the entire purpose of student government, that's the entire purpose of my position, so if I don't do that, then I'm not doing my job at all. Um, <clears throat> one of the ways that I'm supposed to represent students, though, is by appointing students to committees and appointing representatives to university committees, which kind of, they serve as the organizing bodies for the university, they kind of guide policies, they guide programs and different events on campus as well. The biggest plans all stem from campaign platforms, so the biggest one will probably be the registration wait list. Essentially, like right now when students go to log in and register for classes, if the class fills up, they have to check over and over again in the middle of the night to get into that class. They have to wait for someone to drop and then kind of like get lucky and get bumped into it. So what we've been developing right now with OIT is a registration wait list so that it would create a queuing system so that if the class is full, it just has like five people or something like that where if someone drops, they get bumped right into the class. Um, one of the other campaign platforms was increasing the tailgating spaces for student organizations for the Alamo Dome. Uh, originally the university gave 30 spaces for the student organizations, but we kind of negotiated with them and they gave 70 spaces afterwards, so um, there will be a lot more spaces for students to use in the Alamo Dome. Uh, after college I plan to go to law school and become an entertainment lawyer, which has nothing to do with student government whatsoever, but it's based on my experience in theater and other entertainment types of things, I guess. Because I'm proud to be a roadrunner. Yeah! So I ask them, yeah, are you proud to be a roadrunner? You're right! <laughs> <laughs>